Welcome to the introduction to cervical cancer video. This is a part of the WEMS cancer series. My name is Pania Langanason and I am a medical student. I will be guiding you through this video today. What is cervical cancer and how common is it? Globally, cervical cancer is the fourth most common cancer in women. In Canada, one in 168 women are expected to develop cervical cancer in their lifetime, and one in 478 women will die from it. But what is the cervix? The cervix is the lower part of the female reproductive tract, which connects the vagina and the uterus. It is shown here by the green arrow. Cervical cancer occurs when cancerous cells grow in the cervix. Usually, cervical cancer develops slowly and is preceded by abnormal cell changes that are precancerous. This is called dysplasia. What causes cervical cancer? The cause of cervical cancer is infection with high-risk variants of human papilloma virus. However, there are some cofactors that may increase risk. These include tobacco smoking, immunosuppression, multi-parity or having more than one birth, other STIs, or a poor diet, specifically one that is low in antioxidants. The lack of regular screening can also increase one's risk of cervical cancer. This might occur in certain populations such as new immigrants. What are the signs and symptoms of cervical cancer? Usually, early cervical cancer is asymptomatic and found through pap test screening or incidentally on a pelvic exam. Common symptoms of cervical cancer include irregular or heavy vaginal bleeding or bleeding after intercourse, increased vaginal discharge that is sometimes foul smelling or pain during sexual intercourse can also be signs. Those with advanced disease may present with pelvic or lower back pain, bowel or urinary symptoms. How is cervical cancer diagnosed? Cervical cancer is diagnosed based on history and a rectovaginal examination. If a lesion is seen on the cervix, a biopsy is taken. The size of the cancer and spread determines the cancer stage. The stage, type of cancer, patient age, and patient's desire to have children will determine the treatment options. How is cervical cancer treated? Cervical cancer can be treated through multiple methods such as surgery, radiotherapy, chemotherapy, targeted therapy, or immunotherapy. Depending on the extent of the disease, surgery might involve removing all parts of the female reproductive tract or only certain parts. If you're interested in learning more about cervical cancer, check out these resources. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our channel for more informative videos on women's health.